Hello, lovely Sangeeta. Unmute. Hello, Sangeeta. Can you hear me? Yes. Comment ça va? Ça va très bien, merci. How are you? Ça va bien. <laughs> very good, very good. <laughs> no, I should learn French. I keep thinking about it, but I just know a little bit. Uh huh. Which I learned a long time back. So, uh, so that was really good. Comment ça va? What else do you know, Sangita? Mm. Oh, we have Vivian joining us. I, I know a few words. Uh, do you know, uh, my name is Sangita. Hello, Vivian. Je m'appelle Sangita. <laughs> Je m'appelle Sangita. Very good. We are just... Vous vous appelez comment? Oh, very good. Uh, je m'appelle Ariane. Et, et vous? <laughs> et Vivienne. <laughs> uh, I was going to say, hola. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Why not? <laughs> no, well, I'm learning Portuguese at the okay. moment. I learned uh, French at school and I then learned later in life Spanish. Uh -huh. uh, so my head's just a jumble of all of them. That's why I'm thinking, uh, which language should I go into? <laughs> Uh, well, it was better than hi. <coughs> we, we, uh, welcome, I should Pavine. live in France. You, sh you should live in France. <laughs> uh, welcome, Pravin. You just uh, joined us. Uh, let me... In the girly chat. Yes, yes. We were just having a quick... Uh, no, actually, we were talking about languages. Yeah. Uh, Sangeeta. Uh, raise your hand, Sangeeta. Yes. Sangeeta was um, uh, sharing... Her knowledge, her, her knowledge of French, the few words that she knows. Oh, uh, yeah, of course. <laughs> and, uh, bonjour, bonjour. Bonjour. And Vivian was saying she's getting com mixed up between Port Portuguese, you're learning? I'm learning Portuguese, which is a combination of Spanish, French, Italian, and a little bit of Arabic, I think. Um, oh, it goodness. sounds quite different, Go but on. it connects with my Spanish and French learnings from the past. Where are you learning it uh, from or on, uh, Vivian? Are you learning it right now? Yeah, on my phone, um, Duolingo. <clears throat> oh, yes, yeah. Okay, good, it's good. Sorry about my lighting, by the way. If I, I'll try opening the curtains, but it might be too much light. I'm just going to play with that. Yes. Otherwise, we might think that you don't want to show you. Yes, show I'm in shadow. Show. Yes, the symbolism. How's that? Is that better? Too much? No, it's fine. It's, it's fine. Right. Maybe the side curtain if you move the side one. It's better, but you might have to sit more sideways so that the light's not behind you. Oh, I see. That's okay. That, that seems all right. That's all right. As long as you're not blinded by... That's, that's actually my aura. That's not the sun. <laughs> <laughs> it's easy uh, mistake to make. <laughs> uh, so thanks for joining me today. And um, I, we're, we're going to get started. Are we okay with that? Yep. Yes. Oop, um, I'm going to mute everyone for now and then I'll open up. Okay, so uh, yes, thanks for joining me for this Tuesday. I, I love the, the title that I've chosen, uh, Group Task. It sounds like false task, task work. Uh, so we're ready to do some work. Um, I've put this together. So you, you you all know who I am, but let me do, just do a quick intro for uh, the people who are replaying this video um, or watching um, on Facebook that are not joining us on Zoom. Uh, so my name is Ariane. Um, I run CCGM Consulting Limited, a small business consulting firm in West London, uh, where I help uh, entrepreneurs get started with their business or small business owners to move their business forward with online business services. Uh, so this is what I do full time. Um, th uh, this is my full time job. I do some other things as well. Um, I'm also running the Gaia Network, uh, a women in business um, group in West London and a small uh, charity foundation wellbeing trust. Uh, where I help uh, people uh, to uh, live healthier and better through nutrition and healthy living. Uh, so I'm involved in lots of different things and I have my past work experiences to thank for that. I've worked in various industries, property, law support, 
um, events. Um, I originally qualified uh, in international trade. So I did all my studies in uh, France where I'm, I was born uh, and raised. I finished my international trade studies and I came over here uh, to London uh, and home is here. So I have the pleasure of knowing uh, all of you here online today with us. The lovely Sangeeta, Vivian and Praveen, thank you very much for joining me today. And uh, the reason I've put this together is because I want to help uh, as many people as possible to either get uh, into business or to move or pivot uh, their business for the, for the current situation. I had to do the same uh, with mine. Um, and sometimes it's a little bit, uh, it feels a little bit lonely. Uh, and um, this is why I thought doing it together uh, is a great idea. I'm going to structure this uh, for you. Uh, it's going to be quite a simplified uh, version of what I deliver usually with my clients. Um, although um, it's free, I still am here to give you value. So don't think that because it's free, it hasn't got value. I'm doing my best to give you the best uh, with what uh, we have here today. So in the description of the group, it was, um, uh, I mentioned simple, focused, weekly and coached. And it's exactly what it's all about. Uh, we're going to work on simple tasks every week. Why weekly? Because week uh, consistency is key. As you know, in your own businesses, because you are, uh, if you're not running yet your business or even in life, Consistency is key in progress. Uh, little steps, uh, you will achieve great, great, uh, great things in everything, in life and in business. Uh, focused, uh, this is something we're going to work on as well. Uh, by giving you simple little tasks every week, I'm going to ask you to focus on those. Um, and obviously, accountability. I'm here because you're going to be accountable to me. Um, you can do this um, in your own space or you're very welcome to share. I will explain how it works in a minute online. I'm a person who loves to share. Um, as you probably know me by now, I love to express myself. And actually by sharing with some people, sharing helps them progress and see uh, where they're doing right or wrong and um, allows them to adjust things. Um, I mentioned coaching, so I'm a consultant. I do recommendations, but in my previous uh, work experience, I used to be a wellness coach. Uh, therefore, I have some good experience in coaching and I love it. <laughs> uh, so this is for the who I am, why I decided to do this and what it's going to be a little bit about. Um, how it's going to work um, and then I'm, I'm going to stop talking for a minute um, so how it's going to work um, so every Tuesday um, we're going to meet here online um, you're welcome to use your video or not if it's one of those days where you didn't get a chance to get ready for video it's absolutely fine you can switch off the video and still be online um, with us um, so join us at the same time every Tuesday, 2 p.m. between 2 a.m. and 2.30 and discover the weekly task for your small business. Uh, the work that, the task that is going to be announced is something that you have to do in your own time, in your own space. So the, the 30 minutes here is not the time to actually think about it or do it, it's, uh, it's the time to learn the new task that is going to come. So during the week between the sessions is when you have to do your work. And we're going to use the platform of um, one of my groups. I don't know if everyone is on there. It's called Limit, it's a Facebook group called Limitless small business owners. So if you're not on there, 
is called limitless small business owners and this is where i will i already have created different units so you will look for the unit and the task will be there and this is where i was i was saying you're very welcome to share your progress uh, below that uh, unit or within that unit you're very welcome to this is where during the week you can ask uh, uh, recommendations you can ask questions um, i will not i will not answer any questions relating to the task outside that group so i won't answer on whatsapp i won't answer on uh, phone calls this is the the platform to use for uh, the group task uh, limitless small business owners just because i have to allocate some of my time to uh, my clients and to other projects. So this is uh, the right space. So I hope uh, that's okay with all of you. Um, let me unmute for a few minutes. Uh, so far, so good. Do you have any, any questions uh, in, in that regard, Sangeeta? No, I think I'm good. Uh, Vivienne, any questions so far? No, I'm just intrigued by what you're going to set us to do. <laughs> uh, and uh, Praveen, any questions so far? No, no, likewise. There's, uh, I'm waiting to, uh, to hear what you have to say first. No, no okay. questions. <laughs> okay, so everyone's ready. Yeah, yeah, uh, great. <laughs> excellent. So, uh, let me grab my paper. So, very simple task. That is going to the task number one um, that uh, you're going to be allocated this week. Very simple. That is going to help you and also me. Um, I'm, run, I'm going to run those sessions based on the weekly CCGM business tips that I have been sharing throughout the year. But I thought I need to adjust uh, and tailor to what is more required at this moment in time. So this first task of week one is going to help me to do that, adjust the upcoming sessions. So two things for this week's uh, task. Number one is put in writing what you would like to do uh, as your business or how would you like to pivot your existing business? So you, you're, you're, you need to uh, have a think and there's no word limit. You need to uh, take the time to be precise, uh, describe as much as possible what it is that you would like to achieve with your business. If you're in the, in the process of pivoting your business, uh, which means is it used to be something and, and you're trying to adapt it uh, to the current situation or change of mind. I know that uh, Vivian, that's uh, your case. You're currently, you've changed uh, uh, your business. Sangeeta, it's a great chance for you to really sit down and really think uh, what you want to create with all the skills that you have, all, all that, what would you like to, to create and deliver to your audience? Uh, Praveen, I'm taking you as an example. Uh, again, you have all those skills what would you like to create as a business? So it's quite an open question, but it allows you to take the time this week to think about it in details. Mm. Number two is what seems to be stopping you? Uh, and, and I'm using the word seems to be because sometimes we, uh, we think that uh, there are blocks when they're not. And this is why this exercise is important. It can be mindset uh, block. Uh, it could be tool block. So um, it could be something you're fearful of. It could be the thought that you might not know enough about something. So I would like you to really put this down in writing as well. Um, I can share with you later a template that I have that will allow you to uh, do this uh, week week one task. Would you like that? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yes. Sure. So, so this is, like I said, 
simple, focused, and uh, you have the whole week to, to work on it. Uh, in your own space, in your own time, and to ask any questions, okay? Ask any questions online. Um, if you don't wish to ask the questions in the group, uh, you can DM me on Facebook only, okay? So this is, this is it. This is the start of our first session. From there, from there, I will be able to move things forward. So you... It's, it's a collective work. You feed me, I give you. Okay? Sounds good. So can I just repeat the first one is what would you like to do with your business under the current circumstances? Yes. And if you're thinking of pivoting it, how do you do that? Yes, um, correct. And the second one is what seems to be stopping you? Okay, yeah. What's it, but you have to be specific. Yeah. Uh, the more details uh, you put into this, and and you you will realize uh, what, as you're writing it and as you're putting it down on paper that um, actually those are things that can be easily worked on. I think I already know half the answers. <laughs> that's, o that's okay. But please do take your time. Do yes, take yes. your time to do that. Uh, it's not a competition. No. Um, and I have already planned um, next week's task, uh, which is very much business specific, small business specific. But I really want to find out from you this week where you stand first. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's it from me. It's a very short one. Uh, if, who's on the group already on the Limitless Small Business Owners Facebook oh, yeah. group? I think I'm out uh, so it, yeah. uh, please do join there. Um, there's loads of free resources that I share as well online uh, there. I've just sent you the request. I didn't know about this group. Thank you. Can I ask a quick question? Yes, of course, Vivian. Um, regarding part one, putting it in writing, is this about creating our personal vision and goals so that we have a framework and keep us on the right path? Or is it more to let other people know? So... All the things that we do here, all the things that we do here is, is for you. Right. No one else but for yourself. So I, I'm not asking you to write a business plan. Like I said, we're working on very simple, uh, simple tasks. Um, the reason I'm keeping it simple because simple is achievable. Right now, things are moving so quickly that we need to be able to adapt. And adapting requires speed. Um, so we're keeping it simple. We're not overthinking it. Um, doing something is better than doing nothing. Mm. We will adjust things as uh, things progress. Okay. So to answer your question, uh, it's all for you. I will feed from it. I, I will feed from it and I will, uh, it sounds, sounds, uh, uh, not really nice. Uh, I will adjust. <laughs> uh, I'm hungry. <laughs> By the way, I haven't had lunch. <laughs> um, I will adjust the following sessions uh, with what seems to be more of blocks than others. Does it make sense, Vivian? Sounds good. Sounds good. I think so. And will you give feedback on our post? Yes, absolutely. And like I said, um, you're very welcome to share it on the group. I would, because that's, that's the sort of person that I am. But not everyone is um, as open um, as that. Um, so you have the choice. You can do the work in, uh, in your own space and also share it with me uh, by a DM on Facebook, the direct message. Um, I will, I will not share, obviously, what you uh, share with me separately. Um, this is to, again, to help me tailor better the future sessions. So okay. I, I will uh, share. Can you please send me your email addresses to send you the template, if you wish? Shall I do it in the group chat on Facebook? Uh, yes. Can you send the link? Facebook, yeah. Praveen, you're frozen. Ta-da. 
Pravin is frozen. Okay, that's it. Uh, that's <clears> it from me. Uh, Sangeeta, all good? Ready yes, for this? Yes, thank you. Yeah. What I would suggest, uh, what I would suggest from everyone is get a new notebook uh, for this, maybe, or, or uh, separate it. Have have a place uh, where you keep all the sessions together. Uh, this way you can refer back to them. So either use a, a new notebook or the back of a notebook or, or sheet that you will keep together. There's a, there's a progression in what uh, we're going to work on. So should we start once you send the template? Yes. Okay. Uh, you can already start to write while it's nice and fresh. And yeah. as you're in the moment, so as, as we finish the call, you can start working on it. It's a good idea. And I will send you a template that you can keep for yourself. Thank you. Lovely. Short and sweet. Yeah, thank you, yes. Ariane. Uh, uh, your, your efforts are much appreciated. Yes. Oh, Pravin is back. Let's uh, welcome him back to say bye. How come you have two logins? He's yes. a man. <laughs> Hello. Back again. We, you're back Remember again. Last, it was amazing how long I lasted. I didn't actually have the um, it plugged in, so the battery was low. So it just suddenly went. Amazing, uh, lasted that long. Uh, uh, Pravin, I just wanted to uh, say, uh, uh, reiterate what I just said. It might be a good idea for you to use uh, a separate notebook or a couple of sheets together that you're going to accumulate the weekly sessions. There's gotcha. a progression and continuity to what we're going to be working on. I understand. Yeah. That's great. Thank you. And you can start straight away. You've got 10 minutes left of the time that you've allocated for today. So during those 10 minutes, uh, I would actually get started. Uh, there's never be any better moment than now. Uh, so you can get started with the next 10 minutes and carry on during the week. If you have any questions, ask the questions. The if you ask any questions in the group, it might, it might help other people. Uh, so the questions you might have might also help other people. So it's good for you to ask them in the group uh, for that uh, reason as well. Voila! Ta-da! <laughs> Lovely. Thank That's you. Lovely. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks, Ariane. My yeah. pleasure. Um, yeah, thank while, while we're uh, on here, uh, Praveen, I'm sure you won't mind. Uh, uh, Praveen runs a group uh, and straight away uh, with, with uh, James. Uh, and straight away, I thought uh, Vivian and Sangeeta could possibly be interested as well. Oh, yes, that's a great idea. Um, so, just to let you know, it's called um, Adventures in Wellbeing. I never know where I'm looking at uh, the camera. Does that look like I'm looking at you? Yes, yes. that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, because I see other people doing these posts and they just look like they're looking off into the distance. <laughs> so I don't want to be one of those people. Um, it's, a, it's a networking group for like-minded individuals who, uh, it's mainly to do with health and well-being, um, but it's linked around inspiration and what's inspiring you. And, uh, and thank you, Ariane, for the, for the prompt. It's in particular, it's for people who are making this transition uh, with their businesses and making adaptations. So it, it's a balance of personal development, so what's going on on a personal level, but also very importantly as it applies to uh, making money, you know, doing what you love. And this, that's the important thing, doing what, what you love, what you're passionate about, and, and that transition so that exactly as Ariane said earlier on, so that we're adapting uh, and we're, so the worst thing we have is that we're very productive in what we do, but we're not quite in sync with where things are at. And then it's kind of lost the value of what we do is kind of lost. So it's getting in synchronization with, with the current, the, the, the business climate. Um, and, and, and the reason I was thinking of uh, mentioning uh, Praveen's group um, is because it's all about uh, also helping for a better, uh, better whole, um, isn't it? it? It's really much looking at the bigger picture as well. Yes, the community. Uh, community which I'm trying to do here as well yes. so um, because we with every little actions that we do we contribute to a better community better better everything so I thought I thought it would be a good uh, opportunity I didn't plan this but I, th I thought that would be a good opportunity to share 
uh, do feel free to get in touch with Pravin directly. Uh, Pravin, you can... Um, There's, I'll be seeing you this evening. There's a, we have a meeting this evening, seven to eight. We do them on a Tuesday. Um, I think that the topic we're doing tonight is what inspires inspired people. That's, that's the general theme. And then we'll all be contributing in that way. Uh, some people will be just be on a personal level. For other people, it'll be how they've actually then implemented those inspirations um, in their business. Uh, so it could be people that you're listening to, people that you're following online, books that you're reading. It could be yourself. I mean, one friend of mine has already said that they're inspired by their own activities. So, um, and, and themselves, they look to themselves and meditation. So all sorts of things. Um, How do we join, Praveen? Um, it's a, uh, I can send you, um, if I take, can I take, I, ha, I don't know, what's the, what's the most best way to do this, Aaron? If I take your details down, I'll send you the invite. Uh, I'll send you the I'll, Zoom link. Uh, I'm happy to forward you your details, Angita. Yes, yeah, please. Shall and, I, you've got the invite, haven't you? Shall I send it to you again and then you can pass it on to Sangeeta and Vivian? Yeah. If you like, Vivian, I don't know if you, you want to join in. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> Sounds interesting. Yes. I've got all sorts of things booked up today, but yeah. <laughs> yes. So um, yes, we're all working in the in the in the same uh, for the same purpose, uh, and it's always good to have like-minded people around us. The bigger your network in business, the better. Um, it's all very much interlinked, um, as as you all know, <laughs> which is amazing. I I, I simply love it. Time's up. You've got five minutes left to work on your first uh, week task. <laughs> okay, everyone. Okay, thank okay, you. Take care. Bye, thank take you. Care. Bye. Thanks for hosting, Bye. Marianne. Bye. Bye. See you, Vivian. See you, Sangeeta. Bye. See you, Bye. Bye, Vivian. Bye. Please tell your friends. What's that? Please tell your friends about this group. Yes. Uh, please do share. And you can tell them tonight. Well, I'll be mentioning it tonight anyway. Thank you. Bit of exposure. Thanks, sweetheart. Bye,